subscribers welcome back to the channel hope you're having a great day so far as you can see I'm in the car right now driving I actually I'm actually I head around to the beach to see if I can get some fish because um, I woke up with the intention this morning of going out there to get some clips um, so I could um, actually put something together nice for you guys but we had a lot of rain this morning so kind of calm down now and thing the rain kind of cool off so I head around to the beach right now see if I can grab some fish I go head on home and see if I can do a cook up alright yeah man so stay tuned for that guys Yes, the river come down well dirty. Peeps to dip on the beach and one thing. So see if we can get two fish and go in back as you can see the rain and fall right now. Not too hard still, but rain there up and way again. So I see if we can hold two fish and head in back. See if we can do a cook up. Alright, so stay tuned. Yeah, fish in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah peeps, see, train are you again, you know. Number one chef on the beach. At them again. Don't know some roast fish in a pile of paper. Yeah, man. Yeah, Snapper in there and doctor. Yeah, roast breadfruit. That's a good one in the weather, you know. Yeah. So we do it in a lot, you know. Right around us up and Ryan over beach. Time you come from the beach and ask the trainer. Yeah. 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 you have them? Yeah. 
Ayan. Yeah, peep, so me get some fish See ya Now people so as you can see get some fish I head on home right now I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them yet I'm not sure the kind of style I'm going to do with them yet so when we get home then we actually decide and make them know what I want I actually on my way home I will think about it and make them know what I want yeah people so I almost reach home and um, the rain start drew harder now so look like an inside cooking today I was planning on uh, putting the grill outside and all of that and go on with a little thing but that no look possible right now yeah so the rain come down here now yeah see there
Alright, now peeps, so I'm going to go and see fish them. Yeah. And thaw out and everything. So I'm going to scale them up and now I'm do some brown stew fish today. With some fried planting and probably do some festival as well. Alright, so stay tuned. Scale them underneath the water so the scale them not fly. Yeah. We call, we call them the wire back. Wire back, Jack, we call them. Yeah. Wire back, Jack. Give them a second wash and out. Make sure they're nice and clean. Wash them with running water. And the running water, you know. Or if you have a, another container, you can pull the sink again and wash them over you. Which but you wash them again. Because you don't know you don't want to wash them in the bloody water alone. Maybe it's a different taste. You wash them with vinegar, however you want to wash them. You now it's nice and clean. I'm 
and wash them till they see the water clear or bloody water in a day, So you know I come finish wash them and I'm going to cut them up and thing to the proper size of me want them. Then I'm going to get the ball a roll. Have some sharp bone in them, you have to be careful because I look on the one right there. So, this one is very sharp, you know, and I have two actually, two the right there. So, one, two, very, very sharp. You have to be careful, these will hurt them when they cut you, hurt you for days. I'm going to catch me right as a wall, but it never really go through my skin though. Alright, now people, so I'm going to cut up them fish here. Start the cooking, you know. Mm. Look at this. Go slice like that. Them, so I'm going to really cut them too small
sure I cut them here and I try to pick up the fish with a knife and just remember some of the this. Now the one here, I feel like I'm going to do the one here full And do the one here Just like how it is, I'm going to cut it up Probably just put some slice in it and thing And see how it turn out, alright? Yeah So never season them up and out peeps. Don't know. Got some seasoning on them. And then all peeps season up with some maggi. I'm saying I do brown stew, so don't know. 
brown in keep little on it but the people no use brown in and them things they got he use it you know yeah you don't want a lot I'm going to show you how to do it get your knife cap that can actually do the whole thing you can actually season up the whole thing brown up everything When you are cooking, you know, afraid to get your hands dirty. You're actually, cooking, you know. You have to rub in your seasoning and them things there. Yeah, man, once your hands clean, you're good to go, man. You handle the food more effective when you get to use your hand, you know. You get in everything like what you want. Yeah. people so now give it a turn Check out that one here. I'll leave the rest for the one here already. This is the rest now. Get the rest of the fish in. Another pot. Alright now peeps so in the meantime while the fish them I go and fry I'm going to cut the board right here so I have some ingredients that I'm going to put in the pot as well I have the sweet pepper, the scallion and thyme I have hot pepper you know we can do without that onion, tomato and we have Irish potato right here so alright so I'm get these cut up right now Scallion and thyme I'm going to cut up the 
Nintendo o algo así. Eso, un puñado que no me he hecho por Alright, no piece of the gassy. We have the mix this right. And we actually go put them one side and I'll put the other one right there. So, so I got time to get them put down and over. Alright, now we for the same pot when we use seasoning up. If I get some water in it, I will put the water for it. Another pot now. Get some water in that. So I got the vegetables to eat right now. Yeah man, look at that. Look on the colors, the colors are nice in our eats. Yeah, uh, so I got the well, you know, time just drop them on top. Yeah, may I get a little more water in it as well. Alright, now people, so I go on now. Add some water to it. I will cover it down and make it go and cook down, alright? Yeah, so remember, so I'm not really on top chef, you know, I just cook off a vibe. I'm not really cook off a recipe or this to go in first or how my vibe set or some me cook, yeah? A lot of people would have put in the vegetable them first, make them go and cook first and then put the fish after. Which to me seems more logical to do as well, but as I say, cook up a vibe, you know? So I cook. So I saw me I work with it today. Let's see if it ever turn out good. As I said before, I'm going to do some green planting. So I get them plant me a peel up now. And I'm get them frying, alright? Yeah.
one so so get some plant in here All right now people, so then I the one who take out of the pot. So when you press the plant, when you fry plant like this, now that style, yeah, you don't want to make them fry too much at first. So you make them fry a little bit, just soak a little bit, and then you press it. When you press it, you put it back in the pot, in pot again. They actually finish frying, yeah. So I'm show you what I'm going right now. So we're going to press them now and put them back in the oil, all right? So, well, you can use press them. You can either use like a clean napkin or something like that. But uh, this may I use. So you get a piece of the planting skin, put it over it, and press. Once it soak a little bit, you should press easily. You see there? So that looks something like this. So it would look like that. Yeah? So we put this back in the oil now to properly soak. Alright? Yeah. Alright now people so we are gonna check on the fish looking good Yeah man so just in the next two minutes this can come off so what I gonna do now I'm gonna add some ketchup to it Yeah man some ketchup to it and clean them up you know yeah Ketchup now, I'm gonna give it a thickness and also bring out some other flavor in it too. Yeah. So, the next minute and a half to two minutes, when it gets a little bit thicker, I'm gonna step it up, alright? Yeah. Alright, now people, so I'm gonna take out the first set. Uh -huh. See how they look? Yeah, man. That's how it should look. Golden brown. Yeah. That's the first set. I'm going to take out right now. I'm going to add the rest. Let's go. Let's go back in the pot. Alright? Yeah, man. So, normally what we would do, when we fry them, sprinkle some salt over them. Give them a nice flavor. You don't want to put too much salt though. Put to your liking, I should say. Some people um, normally would have salt them when they're in the pot of fry. Some people salt them afterwards. Doesn't matter. You just want a little salty flavor on them. Alright, so yeah. That's what it's going on right now.
Mm -hmm. Right, so these are the slices. So then go very thin. So I'm gonna get these in the pot now, all right? Yeah. So I already went ahead and sliced up the, put it, the Irish potato thin, just the same. So, come on, so I'll get them fry up as well. Alright, now keep this up on the Irish potato and I will sprinkle some maggi. And then, they my different flavor, you know. Yeah, man. So this is the last thing I have to try now. After this, I will put it on the plate. Let me see what I want. So I actually um, put this on the plate now. Let's see how it looks. Drop a couple pieces of planting. Planting over here, so Irish and sweet potato as well. And the other way around, I should say. Irish potato. So, I will get some of the gravy from the bowl. Get some of the gravy from it. Yes, Pete, so see what I'm going on now. This is where I talk about. Look at that. Wow. OMG. Yeah, man, this ready. Ready, ready, ready. Wire backdrop. Sweet potato fry planting. Irish potato. Can't ask you nothing more than that in the rain. Yeah. Rain and fall outside, so listen carefully, you can hear. Yeah, man, so. I'm going to get to this right now. I'm going to actually make some plates for the kids, them. And then we're going to get to it, alright? So stay tuned. Again, you know, well ready. Javina and chips, eh? Now, bread in them plate. Mm. It's nice. Test your fish, you know. See what I go on. Eat ya. Yeah. Nice. Mm. Yeah, man. Nice, 
well juicy, you know? Tender meat, tender, nice, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like Irish potato now. I got chips. Mm -hmm. Nice. Can put the maggie seasoning on this well, well, nice. Mm -hmm. Irish potato. Right now, peeps, I'm going to tell you this. It's a good look. I don't want to stretch out the video too much. so. As I can hear thunder out the door and lightning and flash and them something there. But we have to give thanks, we are on the inside right now and we're warm, we're not getting wet, so we have to give thanks to the Almighty and also we, have, we can provide something to the kids, you know. So we have to give thanks to that as well. And we have to give thanks to life overall, that are the greatest gift, you know. Yeah, man, so always remember to like comment share and subscribe all right if you haven't subscribed as yet please hit the subscription button all right hit the subscription button so we can grow this channel all right so until then stay tuned for the next epic adventure from yard style fishing all right see you soon